Hey YouTube, well instead of a full toolbox tour, we're just going to give you the tip only, or the top drawer. I, I kind of find it inter interesting when I'm watching other people's videos what they keep in their top drawer. Not everyone keeps their, you know, sockets, drive tools, and ratchets in it. I've seen people keep pliers only in their top drawer. A lot of people seem to keep uh, their... Uh, cordless tools up here and I just I find it interesting to what people keep in their top drawer and when I watch tours a lot of times that's only after the top drawer you know I just I, I don't watch a lot of them so I'm not going to show you the whole thing you know not really nothing's changed since my last tour but just to try and keep the video a little shorter uh we're going to do the top drawer only today. So we'll start in the back here with the half inch drive stuff. These are SK six point drive uh, half inch sockets. SK makes good, made in USA. Great chrome finish on them. And the sets go 10 through 36. There's so many in the kit that go beyond the Hanson tray. So I have the bigger ones on the end. This is a Urea Mexican Proto. There's a Carlisle 36 here and a Carlisle 32 in the back. Uh, I guess we'll just go left to right. These hex sockets, these are Titan, half inch drive. Metric, of course. Everything in here is metric. And these are the bigger ones, good for uh, sport bike front axles. Next to them, these are right tool models. And the next row would be a uh, top tool. That's something I should have mentioned in uh, my end of the year ramblings. Is the guy I purchased all my top tool stuff from Dennis Schmidt? He is no longer a dealer. And selling on eBay. So I don't know where you can find those in the US now. The next set is quarter inch drive Vim. And this next little rail here, these are all quarter inch drive sockets from the blue one down this way. These are all 10 millimeter. From here up, we're all 12. And usually when I'm working on a bike or something, this is the rail I'll grab. 90% of the time with quarter inch drive, that's what I'm using. It's either 10 or 12 millimeter. Uh, next to that, we have a right 15 inch half inch drive ratchet. This is another right, the old uh, open head. I'm sure these aren't very popular today. And little extension there. This is a right tool. It's a right tool part number for the US tape. Uh, behind that, Motion Pro uh, 12 point 18 millimeter spark plug socket. Uh, these 12 point drive tools these are right tool they go up to 32 millimeter and they start at 12 half inch drive impacts those are right tool 10 through 27 they skip to 25 25 is a unicorn size probably not going to run across that uh, these hex drive sockets these are carlisle tools from Napa, 3 8 drive, and they go up to 12 millimeter. The 12.38 drive, these sets, these are Carlisle tools from Napa. They go clear up to 24 millimeter and 3 8 drive, so that's kind of convenient. I'll show you the six point here, just easier to get out. Uh, 
Uh, the 3 8 flex drive sockets, these are SK. Your flex are universal. They go up to 24. Good set down. On the Hanson 3 row, 3 8 drive sockets, these are all Carlisle. They're mid depths, they only go up to 19. But the other kits, again, these these go all the way to 24 millimeter. These are the extras, you know, that go beyond the Hanson tray. Uh, three eighths ratchets. I own a bunch. Right tool, right tool, right tool. Carlisle, Carlisle, Cornwell. Uh, right tool open head, right tool flex, right tool three eighths and a quarter inch body flex, right tool, right tool tootsie roll three eighths flex, and right tool three eighths breaker bar, top tool flex with a quick release. Next to that, the new Carlisle I just got last week. The bent handle 3 8 flex with a quick release. Next to that, the Carlisle 100 tooth roto head ratchet. This also has a quick release. Next to that, the Proto 90 tooth 3 8 flex. Very nice ratchet here. Next to that one, the Carlisle 3 8 Flex. No detents, no quick release. Next to that, Carlisle 3 8 Roundhead with a quick release. And the reverse function is this switch right here. I just, you know, that's pretty unique in round heads to have that just flip back and forth. Uh, up front here, these 3 8 hex sockets, these are Blackhawk. And there we have a 3 8 extension there, a longer one, right tool, another back here in the 3 row uh, Hanson socket tray. Uh, the, I guess I kind of skipped these. These are the right tool 3 8 metric. Uh, 6 through 19 with a couple of spark plug sockets on the end. Next we're going the quarter inch drive which I own a ton of. Most of these are right tool but not some of the smaller oddball sizes. Right tool doesn't make like the four and a half and uh, five and a half millimeter. couple spark plug sockets on the end and uh, quarter inch drive three row Hanson tray again these are Carlisle Carlisle very complete sets deep semi deep and standard on this Aries rack here uh, these are top tool sockets 4 through 14 millimeter, no skips. And then we'll go on the quarter inch drive ratchets. Proto 90 tooth flex ultra pro, which is Napa Canada. That's also a 90 tooth ratchet. And we got a 72 tooth flex model, 72 inch locking flex. 100 tooth roto head and up front there at the top tool 72 tooth round head flex and we got some uh, most of these extensions are top tool those are the wobble plus blackhawk quarter inch breaker bar uh, carlisle 90 tooth dewalt compact 72 tooth no quick release Right tool, quarter inch breaker bar. Uh, there's a Cornwell, 30 tooth, 
top tool, 72 tooth with a quick release, Proto 45 tooth, uh, Carlisle 72 tooth, another Cornwell 30 tooth, shorter model, Carlisle round head, again with that unique uh, reverse feature, and the right tool, probably the strongest quarter inch drive ratchet here, and a little Blackhawk. Then we got right tool, extensions, and oh, up front there, that was also just my last video, the big 25 inch Carlisle, half inch drive, that's a 48 tooth model. And then last but not least, the VIM uh, bit driver set, very handy to have. And just, we got a VIM uh, double, or, yeah, the VIM, it only flexes on uh, the ratchet side. It does not flex on the bit side. Next to that, got the Easy Red, which flexes on both sides. And a shorter Easy Red. This is a VIM. This is an Aries. And I skipped the Blackhawk <laughs> quarter inch drive. Uh, this is a flex round head. So that's it. That's the quick version of just the tip or top drawer. Nothing else really new to show you in the rest of it. Nothing's really changed between my last toolbox tour. So that's it. Thanks for watching. We will see you in the next one.